In the future, Tesla will release cheaper and longer range vehicles, improve technology, acquire new ventures, and expand worldwide, likely becoming an electric vehicle and green energy super company. Since its founding in 2003, Tesla has grown from a small EV startup into the sixth most valuable public company in the world. And in just a decade, it has gone from producing a few thousand Tesla Roadster sports cars into mass manufacturing Model 3 sedans in gigafactories around the world. So it makes you think, what will Tesla look like a decade from now? Well, Elon Musk has lots of plans. First of all, he wants to make electric vehicles affordable for everyone. Currently, Tesla's cheapest car, a standard Model 3, still has a purchase price of $38,000, making it too pricey for most consumers. Elon Musk wants to cut this price. In September 2020, he said, About, about three years from now, uh, we're confident we can make a very, com uh, uh, very compelling $25,000 electric vehicle. To help achieve this, Tesla is producing its own newer, cheaper, and more powerful batteries. Currently, Tesla purchases most of its battery cells from Panasonic. These cells have a small component called a tab, which is very complicated to install. In addition, it produces a lot of internal heat, which wastes energy and forces the cells to be thin to avoid overheating. As a result, because the cells are so thin, Tesla has to purchase thousands of them for a single vehicle, increasing production costs. To solve this problem, Tesla has designed its own new tabless battery cell called the 4680. This new cell is easier to manufacture and produces less heat, therefore saving energy and increasing vehicle range. In addition, because it produces less heat, it is now larger, allowing for more efficient packaging and cheaper production costs. Not only is the 4680 a fantastic design improvement, for the first time, it will be manufactured by Tesla rather than outsourced from Panasonic. By the end of 2022, Tesla hopes to have its Texas and Berlin gigafactories producing an annual battery capacity of 100 gigawatt hours. And by 2030, it hopes to be producing three terawatt hours. This vertical integration, along with the new 4680 design, better cell vehicle integration, and improvements in anode and cathode technology are projected to cut battery production costs by 56% in the coming years, while increasing vehicle range by 54%. All this will allow Tesla to lower the prices of its vehicles and therefore reach more consumers. To reach more consumers, Tesla will also expand internationally. In 2018, Tesla began construction on its first foreign gigafactory in Shanghai, China. One year later, in December 2019, Giga Shanghai delivered its first vehicle. Over the next year, the factory helped boost sales in China by 123% compared to 2019, a $3.7 billion increase in revenue. Tesla is hoping to repeat the success in other regions around the world. In June 2020, Tesla began construction on a new gigafactory in Berlin, Germany, that will hopefully boost sales throughout Europe. Once this and the new gigafactory in Austin, Texas are complete, Tesla will have a total of five gigafactories. However, Elon Musk says that Tesla will eventually have between 10 to 20 gigafactories. Some of these will likely be in Japan or South Korea, as they are close to Panasonic. And yes, while Tesla is about to begin manufacturing its own batteries, it will continue working with Panasonic to keep up with demand. Another probable location is India. On January 8, 2021, Tesla incorporated a new branch in Bengaluru, India. Then, on April 13, Elon Musk confirmed that Tesla was expanding operations in the country. As part of this move, many suspect that Tesla will build a gigafactory. In the longer run, Tesla will likely have a gigafactory on every continent. As Elon Musk said in January 2020, The, the biggest problem we, we have to solve right now is just having production on each continent. These factories will help Elon Musk fulfill his goal of producing 20 million cars a year by 2030, a nearly 4,000% increase from 2020. That is nearly a third of global car sales in 2020. While Tesla works to increase its production, it will release a new generation of EV models. In late 2021, it plans to begin manufacturing the Cybertruck in its new Texas Gigafactory. 
and once it starts making its new 4680 battery cells, it will begin manufacturing the Tesla semi-truck. Lastly, in 2022, it will begin production on the new Tesla Roadster, which will be the quickest production car in the world. Meanwhile, Tesla's new award-winning Model Y will drive sales. As Elon Musk said in April 2021, uh, We think Model Y will be the best-selling car or vehicle of any kind in the world, probably next year. While these are the only models currently released, in the coming years, even more Tesla vehicles will come out. One of these will likely be the $25,000 car that Musk hinted at. While Tesla's new vehicles will be cheaper and have longer ranges, they will also be fully autonomous. Currently, all Tesla vehicles have an autopilot feature, which allows them to brake, accelerate, and steer autonomously in the same lane. Now though, Tesla is bringing things to a new level. It is currently developing a full self-driving system, which will eventually allow vehicles to change lanes, make turns, drive on highways, park, and essentially drive anywhere with no human assistance or supervision. Tesla already has a beta version of this system, which it released to a small group of test drivers in October 2020. As of March 2021, Elon Musk said that around 2,000 drivers were testing the system. While the first version had some issues, since then, numerous improvements have been made. On March 5th, Elon tweeted that the beta was getting mature. Still though, the beta requires active human supervision. Before a zero supervision system can be released to the public, Tesla will need regulatory approval and millions of miles of proven, safe, and reliable driving experience. However, once Tesla obtains this, people will be able to sleep in their car overnight and lay back and watch TV while the car drives itself. While Tesla improves its electric vehicles, it will also expand its green energy business. In April 2015, Tesla expanded its business beyond EVs through the announcement of its new Powerwall home battery and its Powerpack energy storage system. Then, in November and December 2016, it made another leap forward through its purchase of Solar City and the announcement of the Solar Roof. Lastly, in 2019, it announced the Megapack, an even larger utility-scale battery. Tesla's solar and energy storage businesses have seen impressive growth, especially energy storage. Currently, solar and wind power plants need a way to store excess energy produced during sunny and windy periods for cloudy and calm periods. Tesla's utility-scale batteries fill this need. Because of this, they have seen massive demand. In 2020, Tesla installed 3 gigawatt hours of new energy storage, an 83% increase from 2019. It has already built large-scale projects such as the 129 megawatt hour Hornsdale Power Reserve in Australia. And now, it is working on even larger projects, including a 240 megawatt hour storage system for Apple in California. While Tesla's solar and energy storage only contributes around 7% of its revenue, it is still very important. As our world shifts to renewables, it will experience massive growth. As Elon Musk said in October 2019, In the long term, I expect Tesla energy to be of roughly the same size as Tesla's automotive sector. It could be bigger. Lastly, in the long run, Tesla will expand beyond EVs and green energy. In November 2018, Elon Musk said, A supersonic vertical takeoff landing electric jet would be interesting to do at some point. I've been thinking about that design for nine years. And in September 2020, he announced that Tesla would one day make HVAC systems. Elon Musk's imagination is constantly leading him to new ventures, as shown by his numerous companies. In the future, Tesla will certainly pursue some of them. In review, in the future, Tesla will release new and improved EVs, will expand around the world, will become a leader in clean energy storage, and will grow its product line. What do you think? What will Tesla look like in the future? Let's talk about it in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, it would be amazing if you like and subscribe for more videos very similar to this one. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.